back-to-back -back throws. Gurley in a receiver slot. Wide open is cut. And spinning out of bounds. Off the throw. And wide open is Cooper Cup. Puts a move on. And inside the 30, a first down for the Rams. Trying to add to it on a third down. Outside pressure picked up. Pass is caught by Cup. He's got another first. And yet the Rams have just been unable to run the football against the looks that should be favorable. Underneath it's Cup coming off the torn ACL. They're glad to have him back. He's got a first down for him. Second and eight play action. Pass is caught. Diving catch, Andy. Rams get up to the line early. Goff backs off. Here's from his head coach, McVay, who's radioed into his head. And here's a handoff to Cup on first. This team's so balanced, they take advantage of that, but not today. Over the middle, wide open. Cup making moves and down to the third. They're challenging him one on one. Goff throws, pass caught. Cup. Room to run. Still going. Cooper Cup, what a touchdown for the Rams. Brilliant catch and run. Sixty-seven yards. And back from the torn ACL. Well, they decided to bring pressure, and you see one-on-one -on -one then across the board with a middle safety and Cuff gets the ball he gets inside they put the ball on him and he's now one-on-one -on, -one on the middle safety and then no chance after that but he's able to break some tackles and just good strong running by by Cooper Cup. They block it one. Goff throws into a ton of traffic and somehow some way threads it to Cooper Cup. Play action, buys time, fires wide open, Cooper Cup. And he'll take the ball into Brown's territory and fights for more yardage to the 43-yard line before Terrence Mitchell is able to... That they gave the offensive line last year. Big to Brown, a roll to the right, brought here by Cooper Cup. And he stop there for a gain of the best, as is every starter in that secondary. Goff has time, fires, and that catch is made. Cooper Cup. Play clock at two. Duff fires. It's caught for a touchdown. Cooper Cup. With Gurley now into the slot. Then a bunch to the right. It's just a three-man rush. And Duff fires. And that's caught. And that's Cooper Cup to the 20-yard line. Three-man bunch to the right. Pass over. Then a wide open is Cooper Cup. Comes out of that bunch. Those play designs are tremendous. The guy right on top of him, watch him give him a shot, and then just sort of lose his balance and unable to get back into coverage. Second down. Got with time. And the throw to Cooper Cup for a first down. Near the 30 of Tampa Bay. Goff. Cup. Slips a tackle. Cooper Cup to the 48 of Tampa Bay. Well, they haven't put up 27 points, but they've also turned it over three times. Cooper Cup to the 20. They're blitzing again. Goff is throwing again. Cooper Cup has a first down. He has a Ram touchdown. You know, can the Rams steal a possession or break a possession somewhere? So when you bring pressure, you're in man-to-man -man situations. And right there, just a great outbreak by Cooper Cup. And he gets past MJ Stewart, some good help. Cooper Cup to midfield and another first down. They've had good field position, just a couple field goals to show for it. Play action. Goff protected. Pass is caught. Flag is down. There's Cup. Back to back catches by two members of their big three on the outside. First it was Woods, now Cup. That is complete to Cop, and he's going to hop out of bounds to stop the clock. Just a three-man rush. Goff fires it, passes, caught for the touchdown. Cooper Cup. 
Now this was not played very well there in the middle. Cooper Cup, he just goes into the goal line and, and just nobody there. Bobby Wagner, he's deep. He's three or four yards deep into the end zone. And, you know, typically those guys, they won't go much further than the goal line, maybe one yard so they can drive on the ball. Cup, nothing difficult about the route. He just gets up in the middle. On second down, Cup makes the catch and cannot get away from Tedrick Thompson. Pass is caught by Cup for the first down. Everett was wide open underneath, and Goff found <laughs> Cup further down. This crowd doing all it can to help. Goff backpedaling finds Cup. A spin and out of bounds with a first down. This is underneath, but Cup gets about 10. Blitz off the edge, Rams pick it up, and Cup is out of bounds with a first down. Have to get to the 47 for a first down. Goff steps away from the rush, fires and completes it to Cooper Cup, the second leading receiver in the NFL. Quick outside to Cooper Cup, and turns it into a nice game with a great move to the outside. Out of bounds at the Falcons, 46 yards. in your scheme because of what Robert Woods is capable of doing. Todd Gurley back in, Goff rolling, Cooper Cup. Casey chasing him, and he's out of bounds at the 14-yard line. One third and eight. Goff, this side of the field, the catch is made. First down yardage and more for Cooper Cup. Cup towards the middle of the field and inside the 40 and close to the 35-yard line. Second and 16, and Goff to throw. Wide open over the middle is Cooper Cup. Goff with time over the middle. Wide open is Cooper Cup. Cup close to the 45-yard line and a first down. Third and eight. Goff with time. Throwing. Guess who? Cup. Brought down shy of the 30-yard line by Jesse Bates, but not before he have another first down. And a first down at the 35-yard line. A little double reverse, a little triple reverse. Garrett Goff throws this side, and it's Cooper Cup down the sideline. Cup to the 15, the 10, the 5. Touchdown. <laughs> 65 yards. The corner for the Bengals ends up slipping and falling. He's in position. I thought there was a missed opportunity of Higby running down the middle of the field. Instead, Goff goes outside to Cup, and you saw Webb on the ground, not able to regain his, his feet in time, and slips on the turf, not able to get up in time. There goes Cup off to the races. I thought Goff missed an opportunity, as I said, with Higby running down the middle of the field. Nobody around him. So I'm going to throw it out to my fast guy and see if he can't score. Goff, wide open is Cup over the middle, and that's a first down across the 45-yard line. Goff, all kinds of time, and going to go deep down the middle of the field, and is caught by Cup. Third down and six. Goff, deep downfield, he's got a man wide open, and that is Cooper Cup, sooner or later. Going to spot him out. And then they say he's in. Touchdown. Two officials look at each other. Cooper Cup. Great read by Jared Goff right here on the fly. Sees the safety comes up. No, he's got a one-on-one -on, -one on the outside. Hits his best receiver and drills this one. The Rams needed a big play and they got it. All scoring plays are reviewed. So if he doesn't get in. So after the penalty of first down, a gap pressure is picked up and a 10 yard out by Cup. Cooper Cup had a nice visit with him earlier today. He's so happy to have Cooks back and Woods called the doubters. Goff gets it to the outside to Cooper Cup. Goff on the move. He can run for it instead throws and gets the first down. Inside the 50, and that's Cooper Cup's first catch of the game. He's got six catches for 98 yards today. There's Cooper Cup. 
leaping in the air and getting down to the 46 yard line. They'll spot it right there, uh, 46 of Arizona. Instead, no spike. Open his cup. Going upfield to the 15. Clock running here. He needs everybody around him to help him out to get to that next level. Couple of number one overall picks for the end zone. Touchdown, Cooper Cup. Goff delivers to his favorite receiver. Leaning to the inside, getting the separation to the outside. There's the first foot down, drags the toe. Great job working the sideline. Ruled a touchdown. Why now, of course, the Los Angeles Clipper. As Goff throws, catch made. Cooper Cup to the 26 yard line, right over the middle. Here he comes back into the backfield. And that will be caught. Cooper Cup in the end zone. Touchdown. What you want to do is occupy these two guys with underneath routes. So they're going to occupy one across the field. There's the other. And then right in between those two comes Cup. That's what you want to do when you're playing against the zone defense. Let's occupy one linebacker and then the other, both with underneath routes, and they can't cover in behind it. You have to have your safety at that point with that little field to operate from. Sneak down a little closer. Goss been clean all night. Clean here, over the middle. That's caught by Cooper Cup into Seahawks territory for a first down. And they're right in the middle of it, one possession down. So a lot of football obviously left. Play action, pass is caught first of the game for Cup. First down, brought down by Lee. And that's really where it began to go south for them. Here's Cup. Gets nine, stood up by March and Lewis. I think they anticipated the fight that they had to put up the, the last couple of weeks. Wentz having to throw get a touchdown by Cooper Cup. That's the first play-by-play -play I think you've done in the uh, 18 years you've been in the boot. There's Cooper Cup, who throughout the entire first half was shut out. Coming off that torn ACL, he's really had a good year. In Third and six, Goff standing in, delivers. He's got Cup for the touchdown. Cooper Cup wide open and Goff put it in there for a 22-yard score. So watch Cup as he ends up coming across field. But what great patience as well by Jared Goff to let that develop because he had another crosser from right to left in his frame, waited for the crosser from left to right. Cup became the open man, and we've been wondering where he's been. Who was that? On third and eight. Protected as Goff underneath in the middle and fighting it eventually Cooper Cup Gets the first down across the 35 yard line. And how does Arizona time their blitzes so they don't get caught? Goff and open right at the 40. It's Cooper Cup Inside the 30 of Arizona. You hear the crowd yelling Coop Running game Rams got it going a little bit on that last drive, but Goff is throwing here and Cooper Cup has it. Flags fly in the secondary as he gets to the 25-yard line. Jared Goff. Catch made. End zone touchdown. Cooper Cup. Let's make sure we know where number 18 is. I mean, he is left completely uncovered as he crosses formation. I don't know who's it, fake. AQ Shipley's in charge of that or not. Meanwhile, the Rams try to add to their lead, and Goff throws low. They're ruling that there's a flag down. They're ruling that a catch at midfield. The flag is back where Goff threw it. According to his coach, it started with the first Arizona meeting. Throwing here, Cooper Cup is open down the sideline. Inside the 45 of the Cardinals, just Cup. Goff. Cooper Cup sheds a tackle out of bounds around the 12 of Arizona.